Hey folks, welcome to the Alliance Pro Wrestling Network. I am your host, Lewis Carlin. Thanks for joining me today. 2020 is gone. 2021 is here. And one wrestler who I think is going to have a big 2021 is Impact Wrestling's Cody Diener. I don't know if you've seen the segments or not. Um, hopefully you have the segments with Cody Diener and Eric Young. Eric Young baptizing Cody Diener in the holy water of change. They were tremendous, tremendous segments. Um, Cody Diener changing completely. I mean, let's let's read some of these tweets here. Uh, Cody Diener, he said, For 20 years, I've given everything to professional wrestling and waited for it to give back. But the parasite latched on to me, and I didn't even realize it. Eric Young showed me the truth. Now am I aware? Now I am aware. The handcuffs are off. I am finally free. And then he wrote, 2021 brings, and he tweeted out, 2021 brings clarity, awareness, awakening, freedom, and ultimately change. 1521. This is fantastic. These were fantastic segments. And I, I absolutely love this character change by Cody Diener. I'm intrigued by it. I know Cody Diener has been um, uh, the same character for the for the number for a number of years now. Uh, it was a good character. It was a good character, but I guess it was it was time to change. And you think you think about someone who's changed. Go back. To, you think about Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan changed. Uh, he changed his character uh, to join the NWO. And um, I kind of think this is like the same thing. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say it's gonna be as big as the NWO, but but Cody Diener is you know. Loved up here in Canada, loved by the fans, uh, loved by Impact Wrestling um, fans as well. And now he's going through this big character change. He turned on uh, Cousin Jake. He, he attacked Cousin Jake a few weeks ago as well. Uh, so this is this is huge. I, I'm looking forward to this. I am looking forward to this. And um, I know on the next episode of Impact Wrestling, it's um, Cousin Jake and Rhino against Eric Young and uh, Joe Doring. And uh, Cody Diener had had tweeted out a picture of that match, and he wrote, "Just waiting." So he's waiting. He's gonna get involved. He's gonna he's going after Cousin Jake again, and I, I wouldn't be surprised if he takes out Rhino as well. Uh, but just think, just think this this new Cody Diener aligning himself with Eric Young and Joe Doring. Uh, that's that's a hell of a faction right there. That's a hell of a faction. And as I said, I'm intrigued by this new character. Uh, the segments are fantastic. If you haven't seen the segments. With with Eric Young and Cody Diener, I would it's it's on Impact, it's on their social media, and I'm sure you can find it on YouTube. Uh, I would definitely check it out because they are just absolutely fantastic. One of the it's probably the best thing I've seen Cody Diener do in a very very long time, and he seemed to have embraced he seems to have embraced this character change because he's he's talking about it on on social media, and. Um, I, I am very much looking forward to it. I, Impact Wrestling really hasn't pushed it as much as they should be pushing it. So to me, that's a little bit of a concern. Uh, but they really, they really should get on board and start pushing this this uh, new character, Cody Dino. Because I um I looked for some news online about it, and then I went to uh, Impact Wrestling social media, and it's mainly Kenny Omega, which is fine. Uh, but uh, if they keep just tweeting about Kenny Omega, it's going to get a little stale. Uh, I think they need to, the social media team needs to put some effort uh, into promoting uh, this new Cody Dina character because it, it's it's going to be a great one. I could feel it. I could feel it. We're going to see a, a great new character from Cody Dina. Of course, he's a heel. Uh, he's not going to be a baby face anymore. He's a heel. Uh, but um, as I said, I'm looking forward to this new character. Um, hell, man, I wouldn't, I mean, we need a new, uh, we need a new, um, heel tag team in in impact wrestling maybe cousin jake turns and he joins uh cody diener and they both do go through character changes and they become a, a top heel team uh to challenge the good brothers anything's possible anything's possible uh but right now let's keep our eyes on cody diener uh every fan in the world of professional wrestling i'm going to say right now let's keep our eyes on this on cody diener and this new character because again and i'm going to say it i said it many times but i'm going to say it again I think it's going to be an absolutely tremendous new character, and it's going to be a very successful new character for Cody Diener. And I, for one, am looking forward to it. And again, 2021 is going to be huge for Cody Diener, in my opinion. All right. Well, thank you very much for listening today. I'm your host, Lewis Carlin. This is the Alliance Pro Wrestling Network. If you like what you hear, uh, 
if you like what you heard here today, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Uh, that'd be cool. That'd be cool if you hit that subscribe button here at the Alliance Pro Wrestling Network YouTube channel. So until next time, thank you very much. Take care. Bye-bye. Stay safe, everyone. So long. Bye-bye.